Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. It's great to be back with you today. And uh, on this episode of Celebrating Act 2, we're with Manny Pacheco, our Hollywood historian par excellence. And of course, my, my amazing partner, John Coleman. Hi, guys. Hey, How are you guys sir? doing? <laughs> Manny, always good to see you. Um, I was looking at your uh, website and blog the other day, and I realized that you are in touch with a wide range of people mm. in Hollywood, filmdom, film fandom. Um, and I, I wondered, what, what websites do you go to? What social media do you use to keep in touch? Well, I use a lot of LinkedIn uh, just because I think it's important that professionals know what I'm doing with regards to Hollywood history. Because I think LinkedIn is a is a site devoted to expertise in different areas, and why not Hollywood history as well? But I, I'm primarily my the, my site to go to is the the traditional Facebook, and uh, and Facebook is very um, friendly to networking with different groups, and it tailors very niche specific groups that I can target depending on the on the topics that we we, we talk about for example on on celebrating act two and you'd be surprised how targeted they are for example I've spent all morning uh, today uh, with a poll that's being taken on the advocates for it's a mad 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 world as to let's say who the, <laughs> the the best actor was in the film, who was the best supporting player on the film, who was the wow. best cameo person on the film, and other people that should have been in the movie, you know, that kind of stuff. And if you hear the dinging, that tells you how active it is because right now I'm on that Facebook site. So every time you hear a bell, an angel won't get its wings. It just means that they are uh, <laughs> actually active on these sites. <laughs> now, now that is targeted, I have to say. That's well, a target. I, and speaking of It's a Wonderful Life, I also belong to Zuzu's Petals. Everybody knows that uh, that uh, Carolyn Grimes, mm. who played Zuzu, It's a Wonderful Life, is still alive. And she has her own website. And guess what? When I was doing the radio version of It's a Wonderful Life last year, playing uh, Clarence the Angel, I was in uh, constant contact with uh, Carolyn really? or Zuzu. And, and because I was on Facebook and a friend of hers and a member of her site. So there's another example of, the, of these great sites that exist on, on Facebook. Yeah, actually, uh, I, I have to, uh, I haven't thought of it that way, but the, there are two or three uh, things that I follow uh, uh, seriously. And on Facebook, even though there's some technical things, there's also a uh, Gene Shepard uh, thread. Mm -hmm. And uh, yes. that's very active as well. So what? Where else, well, where else I, are I've you? I've gone to 70 sites, 70, 70, 70 different sites. So tell us about yeah. some more of them. Wow. Well, my favorite actor, I, I would be remiss if I did not belong to the Spencer Tracy Appreciation Society. <laughs> so I'm really happy to be part of that. Uh, my friend, Carrie Bible, uh, who is the uh, one of the directors at Hollywood Forever Cemetery, she has a site called The Walking Tour of Hollywood Forever Cemetery. I belong to that site. The Alfred Hitchcock fans, why wouldn't I belong to that? And of course, uh, my tribute to, to television, my favorite, favorite TV show, I belong to the Dark Shadows Appreciation Society. Of course you do. <laughs> <laughs> so those are just some of the sites. And, and you know, it all begins with Turner Classic Movies. I belong to no less than four Turner Classic Movie related sites, if you can believe how that. They, how so, do they differ? Well, they're just different fan sites. I would I would expect that there's a lot of overlap in all four of those sites, but I will say that one of the sites might have, let's say, 2.3 million followers, and another might just have 10,760 followers, mm -hmm. for example. So I, 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 it depends on who administ administers the site, and some of these are done with the blessing of Turner Classic Movies, and some, some of them are, are not. So that's how that works, mm -hmm. you know. Yeah. I, I belong to a fan club for Harry Connick Jr. It's called We're Just Wild About Harry. <laughs> <laughs> and I've also belonged to a very specific site because it's important to me as I try to proceed on my documentary about uh, Lionel Barrymore. But I also uh, belong to the Barrymore clan site, which I believe has been uh, approved by the Barrymore family. So, so there you go. Okay. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. 
And I also belong to um, the Cannes Film Festival, a public and private site, two different uh, sites that uh, pay tribute to the Cannes Film Festival. And that's an important one for me because this is my way to keep up with the uh, latest movies that might be coming out in any sure. given year. So, for example, I get a, a jump start on what might be big in 2022 by going to the Cannes Film Festival sites. Yeah. Well, Manny, I think that's what I admire about you and why we love to have you on Celebrating Act Two, is you're really, um, even though you're billed as a Hollywood historian, um, you're really in touch with modern day Hollywood and all the trends. Um, you know, in, it's not, of course, Hollywood is more than just filmmaking these days. Hollywood is television, it's social media, it's, uh, you know, streaming, uh, all kinds of stuff. So you're a great resource for us. And now you've given us your secrets. So, <laughs> well, so see you, Manny. If you want, see ya. For, for see my money, if you want the, besides the uh, It's a Mad, 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 Mad World site, the most active site that I know of is, believe it or not, the James Darren site. <laughs> Very no kidding. Site. Oh, absolutely. When we did our, uh, our, our conversation on the beach movies and I talk yeah. about James Darren and Gidget. Sure. I guarantee you that most of the uh, traffic that we had on our conversation was from that one site. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it, it's, it's amazing to me that some sites are more active than others. I belong to the NBC alumni group, even though I never worked for uh, NBC except for a brief stint as a voiceover guy for Santa Barbara. I guess that qualifies sure. me to be part of the alumni group. Sure. But I, I wouldn't call myself a, a luminary, but boy, I, I, it's an active site and I'm happy to be part of it. So that's just some of the 70 or so sites. And so when we do our chats, I just kind of figure out which ones might interest which site that I belong to. And I, I average about eh, 30 to 40 uh, different sites that I send our conversations to. And so I think folks uh, develop a relationship not only with the other people on the site itself, the networking site itself, but that in turn maybe uh, translates into a, a, a viewership of celebrating Act Two and other uh, uh, contributions that I might make to uh, platforms. Well, I, I will, sure I will tell the audience that uh, I, we see you posted all the time on uh, Twitter and Facebook, and not right. only stuff that we do together, but you have you must release some kind of something at least once a day. It seems that you're yeah. releasing about five. And, and most yeah. of them are just super interesting. Well, I try, and you know, it, it's it is a job. I mean, obviously, um, the, the idea of writing blogs and and generating content started literally the the day after I saw this wonderful movie with um, Amy Adams and Meryl Streep, Julie Julia, which is really a story about uh, Julia Child. But it's also a companion story about how this young lady who loved Julia Child uh, decided to engage in what was a new thing called blogging. And yeah. that, was, that was my, my jumpstart into reaching out to an audience that's out there, or, or let's say uh, 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 folks that have the same interest as I do, uh, and to reach out. And, and I have to tell you, by blogging and by collaborating on these sites, I have made so many friends. I, I just can't tell you how many folks uh, I've made friends with, including a mutual friend of all of ours, uh, Angela Williamson, of course, who is the host of her own show on, on KLCS called Everybody. So mm -hmm. you, through these sites, you'd be surprised how many friends you can make. And, and, it, I, and I recommend it's a great way to network with folks who are like-minded as yourself. Yeah, a lot of fun. And you meet a lot of great people. Uh, and what could be better than talking to people who like the same things you like? Absolutely. I couldn't agree more, like the three of us. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so that means we have to, we'll have to get together again and talk about movies another time. Absolutely. My pleasure. Manny, thanks a lot for sharing your secrets. Thank you, Manny. <laughs> of course. For more on Celebrating Act Two, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends, Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.